Sons and Daughters of God for January 7th. The reading is entitled, That the Church is the Object of God's Supreme Regard. The scripture reading is taken from Ephesians 5 verse 27. That he might present it to himself a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that it should be holy and without blemish. The church, enfeebled and defective though it be, is the only object on earth on which Christ bestows his supreme regard. He is constantly watching it with solicitude and is strengthening it by his Holy Spirit. Will we, as members of his church, allow him to impress our minds and to work through us to his glory? Christ loves his church. He will give all needed help to those who call upon him for strength for the development of Christ-like character. But his love is not weakness. He will not serve with their sins or give them prosperity while they continue to follow a wrong course of action. Only by faithful repentance will their sins be forgiven, for God will not cover evil with the robe of his righteousness. He will honor faithful service. He will abundantly bless those who reveal to their fellow men his justice, mercy, and love. Let those who are engaged in his service walk before him in true humility, following faithfully in his footsteps, cherishing the holy principles which will live through the eternal ages. Let them in word and action show that they obey the laws which are obeyed in heaven. The church is the repository of the riches of the grace of Christ, and through the church will eventually be made manifest even to the principalities and powers in heavenly places, the final and full display of the love of God. The church is God's fortress, his city of refuge, which he holds in a revolted world. It is the theater of his grace in which he delights to reveal his power to transform hearts. God's love for his church is infinite. His care over his heritage is unceasing. Thank you for listening.